Hi, Larry Alterman here, and today I'm going to be talking about which type of battery is most cost-effective to operate. An expensive battery like this Energizer Max Plus, which costs about a dollar each, or this Chinese battery, AA Chinese battery, which only costs about 12 cents each. Now, obviously the Energizer Max Plus is going to last longer, but that's not the question I'm asking here today. I'm asking which battery is most cost effective to operate. Now, obviously there are certain situations where it is worth buying the more expensive battery. For example, a smoke detector on a high ceiling. You don't want to be getting ladders to change the smoke detector all the time because your batteries are weak and you don't want your life depending on a cheap battery. Or another example is uh, if you were going caving and your life depended on this flashlight, you don't want cheap batteries in there. So obviously there are certain situations where it's worth the money to buy the best battery you can. Um, but there are other situations in which it's no big deal to change the battery more often. Like it's easy to change the battery in this remote control. And here is a wireless mouse, also easy to change the battery. Or here is one uh, device that I was particularly interested in, this blood pressure device. It uses four AA batteries, and I was putting in the cheapest batteries I could. I was using it several times a day, and I found that it lasted about two weeks. And I asked the question, well, would I be better off with the more expensive batteries? So those are the tests I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be testing batteries to see which battery is most cost effective. And here are the batteries that I'm going to test. So obviously there are millions of different batteries that you could test. You could spend a whole year testing all the different batteries. But I chose these six different batteries to test. And I showed them here going from cheapest to most expensive. This cheapest is from China, AA battery from China. And it's 12 cents, 12 American cents per battery. And it gets more and more expensive, 13, 29, 42, 86, all the way up for this Energizer battery, you know, the Energizer, the Energizer Bunny, all the way up to 95 cents, American cents per battery, not per pack, per battery. Okay, so I chose these four. Now, in the middle, I thought I'd do something kind of interesting. I chose four batteries from the same company, okay, going from their least expensive to their most expensive. And this is all these four batteries are from the EverReady. They have something called general purpose. It's only 13 cents per battery. Heavy duty, 29 cents per battery. Super heavy duty, 42 cents per battery. And these are all carbon batteries. And then I go all the way up to the gold EverReady alkaline battery at 86 cents per battery. So let's see how these do. So, um... Here is how I'm going to test the uh, batteries. I have this little motor here, which I took out of an electric shaver, and it runs on one and a half volts. And of course, here I have a one and a half volt battery, and I'm gonna connect it up using these little magnetic connectors that I have. And then you're gonna see that the motor is running now. You can certainly hear it, and I don't know if you can see it, it's probably too fast, but the motor is running. And I'm going to run this motor until it dies completely, and then I'm going to record the results. So I did this for all six batteries. I ran all six batteries until they died completely, and here are the results. Okay, so here is a spreadsheet showing the results. In this column, we have the name of the battery, starting with the cheapest, the King Eagle from China, going all the way up to the Energizer AA Max, the most expensive. Here's the cost in American cents, going from a low of 12 to a high of 94.5. And here is, in this column, is the number of hours that the motor ran before it died. With this King Eagle, the cheapest battery, it ran for only 2.1 hours. And as the batteries get more expensive, the performance gets better. 2.25 for the general purpose, 2.7 for the EverReady Heavy Duty, 3.43 for the Super Heavy Duty, 8.63 hours for the Gold Alkaline from EverReady. But then, unfortunately for the Energizer, the one that costs the most does not perform as well as the EverReady Gold, which costs less. So now what I did in this column is I took the cost per hour for running these 
uh, motor for running the motor and that what I did here is I just took the cost of the battery and divided it by the number of hours that it ran to get the cost per hour and with this cheap battery from China 5.72 cents per hour with the EverReady AA general purpose almost the same it ran a little bit longer cost a little bit more almost the same almost identical 5.78 cents per hour but then when I jumped to the EverReady heavy duty it cost significantly more, but only gave me a little better performance, 10.74 cents per hour. EverReady AA Super Heavy Duty, more expensive, again only a little jump in performance, even more expensive, 12.24. Now when I went to the EverReady AA Gold Alkaline, at least there uh, we had a, a little bit of a reduction in cost per price. It, it ran for 8.63 hours, which is very good compared to the others, but it costs a lot more. The operating cost 9.97, almost 10 cents per hour. And finally we get to the Energizer Max. This was the most expensive battery of them all at 94.5 cents per battery, but it only ran for 7.5 hours, better than the carbon batteries, but worse than the gold uh, alkaline from EverReady. And the cost for this battery was 12.6 cents per hour to run the motor. Um, sorry, Energizer battery, but you didn't do so well, Energizer bunny. I'm, I'm kind of sorry. You look so sad. Anyways, um, so here are the results, and the results show, at least for my tests, that uh, if, if you're buying batteries and you're not worried about uh, you know changing the batteries more often or it's not a life-saving situation or something that's really important uh, my tests show that buy the cheapest batteries you can and you will save money doing that so um, that's the end of my video I hope you enjoyed it and I will and I hope it will help you in deciding which batteries to buy thank you